so I ended a 20 year relationship with Safeway. I did it last week and then finally went in to deal with a prescription today, but I'll never give them another dime because <laughs> we're done. Their true colors have shone through throughout this farce, the pandemic, and they've used every opportunity <laughs> to show their customers exactly what they think of them because their measures are actually over the top compared to other stores. And I'm wondering within this natural community in which I live, it's pretty natural what they're subjecting people to and the toxic load. No, I lost it last Thursday when I went shopping <laughs> and as I walked through the door, I got a wave of disinfectant in my face, all over my clothes and my arms, in my eyes. <laughs> I wasn't very pleased, I can tell you. And on my way out, I saw the manager of the store and he responded with the out of the box, I don't give a shit answer. I've been in customer service and all of that for many years and uh, I would never speak to someone like that. And as I walked away, I said, it's clear you don't give a shit. In any case, you know, in times of strife, <laughs> true colors shine through, don't they? Now, I couldn't ignore anymore the liberal, and when I mean liberal, use <laughs> of these disinfectants. I mean like anarchist style, because that's what it is like. Um, last two weeks ago I was in and I eat a lot of fresh like pretty much my entire diet is fresh uh, no bags mangoes watermelons you know stuff like that and I eat a whole one <laughs> and the girl with the mask was spraying she must have sprayed the disinfectant 20 times now I try to buy organic <laughs> <laughs> but even if I have to buy some of the pesticide stuff because there isn't a selection, I can tell you, um, I don't want it in contact with that because these are biocides. They call them biocides. They're, they're actually fungicides, herbicide, pesticide. They're every side you can imagine. It's not good. And these are highly antibacterial means they kill everything all the good stuff all the good bacteria now antibiotic resistance has been a huge issue for the world the powers that be know that so do the biotech set because they're the ones <laughs> reaping it in right now, aren't they? These disinfectants have been mandated. And as a customer, I can tell when I'm walking in that it's not good. Because I don't feel great after I leave. But that continual element within a closed environment, and particularly when you've got organic produce, that organic produce is no longer organic, guaranteed. Under organic regulations, when I ran an organic packaging business, we could use hydrogen peroxide, non-chlorinated bleach. Any other type of cleaner was such a nightmare to get dealt with because it was, the MSDS never passed. And I can tell you the MSDSs on these chemicals that they're using don't pass. What's interesting about them is that the store manager gave me the name of one that they used last week. He called it Triforce. But this week, 
the guy told me it's triple play. And when I questioned him about that, are you sure you're correct? Show me the bottle. But also, he told me that they change them every week. You just don't know what's going to come in. You know, I know the unions are part of all of these new regs, and I'm wondering why they would choose to expose their workers to these toxic chemicals day in and day out. Now, they've mandated in Safeway that they have to wear masks, which is an entire day of not breathing proper oxygen. But maybe they are protecting them from the disinfectants and just subjecting their customers to it. In any case, it won't fly with me. And now I'm getting a workout <laughs> to get my groceries. And it's all cool. Um, I like to know where I stand and I like to know the truth. And now I know that the thousands of dollars that I spent there over the years, <laughs> they never cared about. And it means absolutely nothing to them. Kind of like a lover or a husband that's always messing around, right? Same thing. What you need to do is get back on a proper path and make sure that you are surrounding yourself in environments that are conducive to your health. The corporations, if you're working for one, you're going to be subjected to this. The kids in school, subjected to it day in day out they are going to be disinfecting the hell out of those classrooms i'm telling you when public health and these corporations and governments start mandating the use of toxics under the guise of public health you have to wonder <laughs> Are these people mad? They have to be because they lack absolute common sense and they've restructured a world under COVID-19. Why didn't they ever restructure the world all around cancer? Oh, I know because all of their products that they sell every prescription, every medication, the vaccinations, the herbicides, pesticides, all of these chemicals. <laughs> well, of course, they'd be outlawed, wouldn't they? Exactly. Going forward, we have decisions to make and mine include not playing ball in a system determined to kill me. What about you?